Here's a Magnum power clip, 360 nailed. Underneath the green ring that you see there, on the key, the clip, that is a bait cup. You can see I have a little bait in there, it's hard to see. This is what I really want to see when I come up on the set. See how the chain is down? Hi trappers, this is Shane, Papio Creek Trapping Supply. It's starting to warm up here. Uh, it's still the first week of January. But as I was saying in the introduction here, here is the Magnum 360 power clip. This clip can turn anywhere you want to turn it to. It's also a bait caddy. I like to keep that ring on there, but as you see it fired, no problem. You can run your screw or nail down through your chain, or you can put it on the ring. I have some older 220s here, and the rings are bigger. Anyway, here's what I got at the, at the log pile. That's a really nice skunk. Real clean white lines. That's what we're looking for. Nice clean white bottom. It's a nice, it's a nice skunk. Very worth uh, catching. It does not smell here. It broke its back immediately. Uh, otherwise there would be spray everywhere and I wouldn't really enjoy standing here but again we smell this stuff all our life if you've been trapping. Anyway as you can see I like to see I like to have my chains down with fur in it and with the magnum power clips you can come up as I've got one right here and I've got the Papio Creek bait tube on the triggers now you can put bait in there you can put cotton in the bottom of it, squirt lure down through the, the top to fill, or you can put bait in the bait clip, and what happens is the animal comes on up the log or down, starts to feed in the bait clip, in, in the magnum power clip, and pushes his forehead into the triggers, which in turn, This is what we get. Hey, try the Magnum Power Clips, guys. I'm telling you, and gals, uh, they're going to put fur on your stretchers. This is Shane. Thanks for watching.